the 2015 Concordia Seniors here. We beat Vanguard on senior night. Guys, let's just go down the line and kind of talk about what your time at Concordia has meant to you. Uh, it's been a special time. Uh, the friends, the brothers I've uh, created over the last four years has been incredible. Uh, unbelievable time. Best five years of my life, you know, from friendships, memories. Uh, these guys are like my brothers, and um, I wouldn't have tried to spend my uh, college career anywhere else. I've only been here for a certain amount of time. It feels like I've been here for a lifetime. I've created so many relationships with good people. It's proud to be here. I'm proud to be here. I need all that, man. I, yeah, I love being here. Like, the bond is the bond. And, like, the fellowship that we created here. That's the most fair. We're just trying to end this year out with a big. On that All right, guys, your season's far from over. Big win tonight. What's your guys' goals? Because you guys are definitely headed to the postseason, definitely going to be in Kansas City one way or another. Uh, we want to finish out strong, uh, going to this conference tournament with the mindset of winning it and taking that momentum to uh, Kansas City uh, at night inside and winning the whole thing. Yeah, it was a big win for us. Um, it definitely is a confidence booster going into the conference tournament, which is a hostile environment, so it was great to get this win tonight. <laughs> Alright guys, well congratulations on a great career so far and we're looking forward to more from you guys in the next couple weeks. Thank you. Concordia head coach Ken Emmons, the Eagles pick up a senior night win against Vanguard. Coach, a real tough game, you guys led a lot of the way, lost it briefly in the second half but fought back. What was the key for your guys tonight to, to get this win against Vanguard? Uh, just, I don't know, it's, it's just got to find a way to, to get uh, good shots and, and get stops against them. They play such good defense, they're so physical. And they play so hard. It's just hard to get. Uh, you just got to make plays and make a few more than they did, which we haven't done the last few times we played them. And uh, we found a way to, to get a win tonight. And uh, it felt good because we haven't beaten them in a while. You, know, you guys put a nice little run on them and late in the second half. They're led by, I believe, eight or nine with three minutes left. But things kind of slowed down for you guys offensively. They came back, got within two. It had all the writings of, you know, disaster. But you guys staved it off. What did you do over that stretch to, to hold your lead and, you know, grind out a, a game that got really close? Yeah, there were some runs that went both ways. And, uh, you know, they're a resilient team. And, uh, you know, one of, the, one of the best teams in the country that just hasn't finished as high in, as, in league as they wanted to. But, um, you know, they, they just kept fighting and we kept fighting. So it was a, it was a great game to be a part of. And, uh I was, was glad to win that one on you know for our five seniors who are such uh, class acts uh, for so long. We had some great seniors: Talon, Josiah, Tommy, Lucas, and Ty. And uh, you know it was great to get that done for them. You know, led me into my next question right there. You know, these seniors they've won a lot, team success, individual success. They've they've come at different periods of time. You know, just touch a little bit more on what they've meant to your program through the last five years for some of them. Well, they're, they're five great players, but uh, more than that, it's five great people. Um, they mean so much to our program, and our program will take a real hit uh, in all the intangible things we, we try to emphasize. When those guys leave, uh, it's going to be hard to replace them. Um, I appreciate their attitudes and, and uh, so much, and they're just great, great teammates. All right, now we're done with the regular season. You guys finished second in the GSAC, going to get Biola in the GSAC first round. Entering the postseason, now you guys got a trip back to Kansas City on your mind in a GSAC tournament championship. So what are you guys going to be looking at this week as you get ready for a postseason play? Um, just do what we always try to do, uh, you know, one, one step at a time, play anybody, anywhere, anytime, and we're ready to go. And uh, we want to we win uh, We want to win that GSAC tournament if we can, but it, you got to get through the first opponent, which is Biola, and they're really, really good. So uh, it'll be a tough road, but we wanna, we're hungry and we want to get it done. All right, Coach. Well, congrats on a great regular season. Always nice to win on senior night as well. So congrats on that. And wish you good luck in the postseason as you guys keep going here.